From the courts, nine people were arraigned for firearm-related matters today. Ricardo Major of the Berry Islands pleaded guilty to his possession of a firearm. However, he heads back to court tomorrow for sentencing. Also in court today was Kevy Nixon, who pleaded not guilty to a firearm-related charge. It's alleged that he threw a pistol with eight rounds of ammunition underneath a vehicle last week when spotted by police. He was granted bail in the amount of $9,000. Also, 64-year-old David Pinder of Spanish Wells was charged with possession of ammunition. He plead, pled not guilty and the case was adjourned to March 4th in Harbor Island. He was granted $8,500 bail. Renato Wood and Omar McFallon were charged with possession of a firearm and 15 rounds of ammunition. McFallon was also charged with three counts of deceit of a public officer. He pled not guilty to firearm and ammunition charges and pled guilty to deceit. The matter was adjourned for sentencing tomorrow. Four other males, two adults and two juveniles were charged with housebreaking, stealing and possession of firearm and ammunition. A Grand Bahama businessman was back in court today seeking bail. However, he will have to wait a bit longer as that bail hearing was adjourned. Last week, 47-year-old Edwin Dudley Barrett was charged with 25 firearm-related offenses, including possession of high-powered weapons, including an AK-47 pistol. Because of the nature and seriousness of the offenses, the question of bail was deferred. The bail hearing got underway today, but lawyers are expected back in court on Wednesday to continue arguments. Barrett was one of four people from Grand Bahama charged in connection with high-powered weapons recently. 31-year-old Rajiv Dames pleaded guilty to 34 firearm-related charges and was sentenced to five years in prison. He has, also, he has to also pay a fine of $7,500 to avoid spending another year behind bars. As a result of his guilty plea, the prosecution withdrew charges against his wife, Katina. The couple was arrested in connection with that big weapons find on Grand Bahama about two weeks ago. If you know of a crime, please call Crime Stoppers at 328-8477, toll free 242-300-8477. You can also check them out on www.crimestoppersbahamas.com. Let's stop the crime before it's your time.